Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to Austria Campaign. In EU4 with me, your host, Lucky Marine, and we are... We're trying to get everybody back into the fold. By revoking the privilege yet again. However, four of them don't want it. Poland, Galicia, Galicia, and Leon. So we're going to go directly to them. We're going to increase. Improve the relations. Galicia, Quite a lot of aggressive expansion though. Leon. Accept that. Improve relations. And improve relations. I don't think we need Brebren in this fight. Anyway. Get out, and back in. We'll go take another lump out of uh, Russia. Oh no, this is a defensive war. You see, this is what happens, Ryzen. This is what happens if you try and go alone. Then Russia comes and he's big and scary. However, if you stay in the group, if you stay with the group, then we all sort each other out. We all help out each other. Except Poland, because he's a dickhead. And he, he doesn't want to play as part of the group. Everyone else does. For everyone else it's working fine. But no, not Poland, not Glicelia, Volinia, not Leon. They all want to do their own stuff. Excellent. Now five princes for the reform. So if we click to right now. I suppose it helps that we've come to the aid of a member of the empire. But if we were to click right now, everybody would be on the same page. Livonia have been adding people. HR um, Crimea are adding stuff. Love it. Where are you going? I got you. I get you. Investing in your idea. Infantry combat ability? Why not? It'll help when we become the big. I don't know what color blob it is. Yeah, just continue to feed in there. And then give them the good news. Whoa, glorious victory. Of course, Razan was in charge of it. Okay. Poland will seed Polosk and Vibek to Polosk. So they did a really good job of doing all this for us. Okay. That's amazing. I should just let Russia attack us more often. So, so from that, uh, Ryzen give the Great Horde a lot of stuff. They stayed the same size. They gave Novgorod a lot of stuff. Novgorod, Great Horde, even Plots got something. Well done, Ryzen. Well done. Good work. I like that. Anyway, ninety-four princes for the reform, and we do have ninety-four princes. Demand oaths of loyalty. Okay. National decisions. Construct the Kiel Canal. 10,000 bucket. Why not? Actually, no. You get a lot of events with that and it pushes it back and it puts... I don't know. We, we don't need the keel now. It, it just allows you to go through here just that little bit quicker. No, we don't need it. <clears throat> anyway, we were going to have a look in here. 
Now we had everybody on, what is it, uh, aggressive. So anybody who's not on aggressive are ones that have been added. So 24 troops from Brittany, 15 troops from Bulgaria. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. 17 countries have just been added. Not bad. Not bad at all. Almonds. You come back. Declare war for just anything. Let's go. I just want to test out our new uh, our new people. Superiority is seventy five percent aggression, but so is imperialism, and it's seventy five percent cost. So. We'll go flying instead. I'm expecting at any point to press that button and just everything crashed back to desktop. So what? how many people have we got now? We've got well over a million. Well over a million troops just cutting around. The amount of attrition already just from walking into, uh, walking around the place. We don't need the ducats, we need to lose the inflation. Anyway. Let's not take attrition ourselves. And we just sit back <clears throat> and watch our million strong men Messy almonds up. Are you bored? Me? Hey? Yawning directly into the microphone. Again. Okay, Riga. Um, Novgorod, do you want this land now? Actually, no. We can demand that he takes it. Novgorod. I don't think we can do it whilst we're at war. But now, now they're on this list. We can just grant province and give it to them, and they'll have to take it. Don't want to pop out Kasim. Do, do I want to pop out Kasim? We're already at 94 prince. I'm, did we lose a prince? I'm sure we had 95 at one point. Did someone decide not to be part of the game? Don't think so. Doesn't look like it. Oh no. Anyway, let's not take quite so much aggress um, attrition there. Skazia have insulted us. <clears throat> Trebizond, have you got anything in Skazia that you want? Nope, but Crimea does. Guaranteed by who? The Ottomans. Bless you, Sarkasia. Sarkasia. I'm sure the Great Horde would want bits and pieces from you as well. Fly mine pretties. And we'll go for Diplo Rep. A whole plus five Diplo Rep. That is insane. Overextension. Overextension, really? What have we got overextension from? Voroneth. Where are you? Oh, of course. 
We need to call it so it can add this to the empire. It must be that way. Excellent. Yes, occasionally you're not insulting me now, are you? You watch, it'll just be a babbling bit and you can't help it. Yeah. Well, that's why you have advisors. You can't have babbling buffoons just gobbing off next to this monstrosity. It's not going to work well for you. No. Vatican infiltrated. Uh, prestige. Yeah, prestige. Either prestige? Yeah, we could do with that actually. We're swimming in points. Diplo rep, why not? Let's grab that. Now Crimea. <clears throat> okay, let's transfer control of this to you then. And this. this to the Great Horde. Is it the Great Horde or just Great Horde? Great Horde. You, Great Horde. And again. Who is this? Astrakhan. After I can. Okay, we'll take these for ourselves so that we can add to HRA, add, 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 release after I can. So we're going to be releasing Cuisine. Do we need to? It's only going to be a two province minor. No, we need to add as many as we can. I want the HRE to be above a hundred princes before we uh, fully integrate. Master can. All right, we'll leave that from for Sarkasia, or get that from Sarkasia. And this, 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 this. All of this. As of. Do we measure out? Sure, you're yeah, you're Crimea. And then a line up here for ourselves, and a bit extra. That'll do. Fine. So you got bigger, you got bigger. <clears throat> we can call you change your religion, add you to the empire. Okay. We'll get on that. And then from there we can release Sagasia at our leisure. At our leisure. And Astrakhan. 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 But we'll just. We'll call this. We'll change the religion of this. And the rest. And that'll be after I can released as a, a five province lump for the moment. Now, Ottomans, where were we? Back to kicking you in the face, I believe. Can we release Georgia? We can, excellent. Truth Portugal has expired. Good. 
We need to push them off the European. Well, push them out of Iberia. Georgia, Georgia. All of that is Georgia stuff. Is Trebizond still around? Yeah, they are. Okay. For this war, we'll aim for releasing Trebizond and Georgia. Persia. Persia are all the way up here. Persia is all the way up there. I'm not surprised actually. Alright, we'll grab that and we'll grab a walkway. And we'll try block. We'll try block off the uh, Ethiopians from getting too far up here. Alright, that. Shouldn't take too long to achieve. One more take. There we go. Nope, stop, stop. Game, please stop. Excellent. We'll gain the prestige. I just remembered. We have we have a colony in Africa, don't we? That we could feed by going directly to Walt with England. Well that the Great Britain. Which will happen. But for the time being, what is going on here? What was my plan? My plan down here was to cut off Ethiopian expansion up into the Levant. Um, for the time being. Didn't realise that Persia got all the way up here. But also, we need... We need to call this. We'll call this, we will convert it, or we'll convert the rest of this as well. <clears throat> then we'll release a, a Georgia Trebizond, we will get you called. You can grab your HR Enus from Kaffa. And Pontic. They'll probably accept Turkey. What kind of rover extension do we have? Mm, quite a bit. Is there anything we can fob off to people right now? Yeah, we could give this stuff to the knights. Alright. Knights, we're going to feed you. You ready for the feeding? I reckon he's ready for the feeding. Ooh, Cyprus. You did take religious, didn't you? I'm not about to mess you up. Yep, took religious. Full religious. We can feed them all of this. Cyprus. Grant you Gaza, Jerusalem, Karak, Halgen, Do we feed them in this as well? I think I think we do. Maybe. Syrian. We wanted to pop out Syria, didn't we? I think we're beyond popping out countries. I think we're just going to end up going for client states. 
Might as well give it to Cyprus. Plus the smaller we are, the quicker it is to go. as well because shall they yep nice thing about revoking the privilege is that you don't have to sell people provinces you can grant them provinces so you're not tanking your uh, your prestige quite so much and it's easier to do and quicker and can it Trebizond will save you. How's that? 156. 105. You're 16 developed. I'm sure we can fob you off onto the Great Horde. Sorry. That should bring us underneath. There we go. Right, I'm fine with everything else. Also, these. Yeah, we already planned for these. We will pop in out. Kazim, Smolensk. Belong to Ryzen. Ryzen. Now you have no option to take it. Ryzen. Grand Province, Smolensk, take it. Oh, steady. Novgorod. Novgorod needs Pliskov. Livona needs Riga. Even though they didn't want it before, they will take it now. And Golden Gun. Okay. So that's all our land in this area that we've given away. Like, apart from this that we need to keep in order to pop out Kazim. This that we need to keep in order to pop out Georgia. Um, this we need to keep to pop out Circassia, when we eventually eat what's left of them. This for Astrakhan. And this for Trebizond. We will get up to 100 princes. We will get up to 100 princes. We're at 94. Easily get to 100 princes. But, our truce with you is over. Spain will come in. However, we do need a direct war against Portugal. I'm not so bothered about the aggressive expansion, it's just... Yeah, we need to start taking some of these provinces off him. I don't want to be messing about for too long. Also, Britain. There's going to be a point. Right, let's do it. Dissolve the alliance, five years time, pop out a Normandy, feed him Northern France, get back in Sweden, feed Finland. We can do it right now. Yep. But that, ladies and gentlemen, will be in the next episode. The, uh, the empire gets ever, ever bigger. And at the last count, in the last war, we fielded an army 
of above a million men. Now I've seen <clears throat> I've seen wars end with a million casualties. But can you imagine a long protracted war with somebody who has a, who can just field a million men? It's just it's gonna be ridiculous. And we if when if and when we press this button for the entire HRE to become one country, there is no way <clears throat> there is no way we're gonna have over a thousand force limit. So it is it is more cost effective to keep all your guys around as long as, long as you can run the computer this is more effective anyway I've been looking Marine as always you lot have been amazing join me next time for war with Sweden to feed them and war with Portugal directly to feed him um, I also want to give Sicily or maybe even Sardinia, uh, parts of Spanish Maghreb, if they will take it. I'm sure they will, now that we, we don't have to sell them the provinces, they don't they don't get to choose if they take the province or not. We grant it to them and they have to take it. But thankfully I think they all pop out with full religious. No, you haven't gone full religious, how about you? Oh yeah. Sicily has full religious, so we might end up giving it all term. Although it might be Catholic. Oh, it's Catholic. Fair enough. All right, so we'll split between uh, between Sardinia and Sicily. And that'll do. And that will do. Until next time. Do take care.